Today I'm going to walk you through logging into command all the way to starting a room in DocuSign. So you'll go to agent.kw.com, which brings you to this login screen, and you will use your MyKW login and sign in. To access DocuSign, you will do that through an opportunity, and to have an opportunity, you need a contact. So we'll start in contacts. And if you're working with a new client, it's really good practice to right away make them a contact in your command so that you have um, all of their contact information where it should be. Then you'll go to opportunities. And in the top right corner, you'll hit create an opportunity. I'm going to do a buyer and you will search your client here. If your client is not already in your contacts, they will not pop up like that. You can add a co-buyer if that's the case and rename the opportunity as well. The required fields are commission rate. I typically always start at 3% and that is something you can change when it comes time to fill out your commission. Then you'll fill out the opportunity phase and the opportunity stage. I have an active buyer and we are showing houses. So I'm gonna say create. This will take you to the details page of that opportunity. But to show you the full picture, I'm going to re-click opportunities where you can see all the current opportunities that you have, whether that be listings or buyers. So I just made this an active buyer showing homes. And I'm gonna click on this opportunity which then does bring you back to this details page where we were just at. When you hit documents, this is how you will access DocuSign. It's important that when you're showing homes or going on listing appointments to always have those people as contacts and start them an opportunity right away so that when it comes time to fill out paperwork, you already have that opportunity ready and you can open it up, go to documents and hit start transaction. When you hit start transaction, you may have both DocuSign and DotLoop as options if you have sank both of those to your command settings like we did before. We will be using DocuSign. And once you select DocuSign, it will bring you to a room where you can add documents. We have a further video going over all the details about adding documents and sending them to your clients. So I'm going to go back to command now to show you that anytime you pull back open that opportunity, all you have to do is hit go to transaction and it will retake you right back to that room. So your access point for DocuSign is always going to be inside of your opportunity. You can click out of your opportunity and go home, for example. And if you had an additional addendum that needed to be sent, you would go into your opportunities. Go to that active client. Open up the opportunity. Toggle to your documents. And when you hit go to transaction, that brings you right into the room where all the documents live for that opportunity.